Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to some more Let's Play Fell Seal Arbiter's Mark. In the last episode, we did more patrolling, getting some more experience points for our Arbiters. Originally, I had intended for all my Arbiters to be roughly level 18 before I adventured over here. I wanted to do a few of the odds and ends first, getting a hunt done, trying one of the large combats, and then when I picked up some higher level creatures, the two Arpias that we have, Talion and Glint, I wanted the rest of my team to be roughly their levels as well, which is level 18. However, I think we're done with the patrolling for the time being, and I think we'll go ahead and begin worming our way towards that temple after all. Mostly because I could get distracted by this for like several more videos, and while I know that some of you won't mind me doing that, I'm beginning to forget what we're even trying to do. <laughs> and I don't want to get distracted by, like, 30 hours worth of random patrol fights. And then not remember what's happening in the main story. So, let's head over to the Old Bazaar. We'll take a peek at the treasures. Oh, sorry, treasures. At the equipment that's for sale here. Just to see if anything's better than what we're currently using. I don't think it will be. And then, we will actually head on off to the Gorge, and then to the Spires, for some actual story stuff. Oh, should we do equipment management slash class stuff? I don't think so. Uh, we'll, skip, we'll even skip that at the moment. We're just going to go right to the shop. I'll check one or two things to make sure that we're not uh, leaving behind some better equipment before we move on. And we're not. I can see that the weapons have not improved at all. And we still have the gold shield as, like, the best type of shield. And you know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna quickly look to see who doesn't have a gold shield and give them gold shields if I have any steels left over. Or something that isn't, like, an earth shield or something. Because I need the... I need the magic resistance more than I need the defense at this point. And everyone else has one. Okay. All right, that's it then from our purchases. All right. So, well, without any further ado, let's go ahead and visit the Erzertara Gorge. And we can get Dragon's Blood Sap here as a gatherable. Really? Interesting. Okay, that's not, that's not impossible to get then. So we can make even more crests if I so desire. All right, uh, these long abandoned mining tunnels are now home to troglodyte giants. Oh my goodness, that sounds horrific. Let's kill them. There's Zaktag Gorge, defeat all foes. All right, so before we do that. Oh, um, I think I can get this. Hold on. I would have to bring Talion. I think Talion has item user. Is that right? Yeah, she has tool user. Character can use items. Situational commands do not cost an action. I think she could get this treasure chest. We're going to deploy her. And she's going to stare right at that treasure chest. That's the whole reason I'm bringing her out here. Okay, so first person deployed. <laughs> Next, we're going to bring Pellier as well, because I can swap out Talion for a different lower level pet with him. Since I'm bringing Pellier, I actually want another pet with me. We'll bring Suzuki again. And now I want lower level people. So... That's going to be... I only have one level 16 and she's wounded. Let's... Uh, do I want to bring Rainer? I do. No, we'll stick with bringing other people. Let's bring Kiri. We'll bring... Who else is level 17? Yates is barely level 17, so Yates will bring you. And then Anadine. 
Alright, so this is our this will be our squad today. What are we fighting? Now's a good time for me to look at that, I suppose. Level 15. Deft to black eye. Can't be blinded. What is he? Whirling blows. He's a close range AoE. Precise strike, so he can't miss with that attack. Into the fray, the clo the more enemies that are surrounding him, the more damage he does. He also has tool users, so he can use items. We have an ancient zombie. A Myconid Strawberry Cellphite is up here. I guess we can try taming something. That must be where the dragon's blood is. Oh, it's not actually literally dragon's blood. It's a type of fruit. I thought it was actually a, like a literal blood from a dra blood from a dragon. Oh, there's another... There's two sugar chests. Look at you there. Okay, well, I think we're done. So, let's go ahead. I'm taking a, a quick peek at these guys. They don't look... I mean, a lot of hit points on some of them. Snack stash? What does this do? Unit gains two random buffs. Okay, he picks from his, the uh, bag he's got. Let's look over his shoulder. All right, I, th I think we're I think we're set to go. Let's do it. How odd! That cadaver is clutching an old letter in its fist. The whole reason you are here is for this reason, Talion. We got a bone crest. Oh, is that the? That may be the Lich thing. All right now, I can't swap her out at the moment, because if I do, uh, I can't get whatever creature I summon in to join us. So we have to wait one round at the very least. So... Let's use... Nothing. We'll hold on to our points, I suppose. All right, so now is, now is when I, as normal, do the... Where can these creatures move? How much threat am I, am I in? So, if I move up, I gotta be a little careful. 208, yeah, they hurt. 218 attack. I don't worry about the Pectites till next round. Alright, Pellier. So, let's move you... Which, which direction do I want to head in? I think this one. Actually, Tim, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. If you go that way, then you're going to be hit by this Pectite. It's going to come down here and then begin blasting you on this side. If we go up this side, we could kill that one. And this one's a lightning one. That one will take some time to get to me. I think we do go up this way and we risk taking some hits from the Potrolo Tablaki Death Blargler. So we'll do that. So let's move you... Here? And we'll just end your turn facing that way. Yates. So. Uh, I suppose we'll mass thorns. The girls? And yourself? Yeah, let's do that. And you'll just end your turn. Alright, Kiri, we're slowly... Oh, I have to be careful of the whirling attack. Which one is this? That one's not... Uh, that one's going at... Oh, if I move you here... What counter do you have? Do I really want to do this? I do. I need to climb. I, I need to. Suzuki. I can't get you to where I want you, which is there. A 
let's use Anonymize. Take a lot of damage, but now you gain a little more movement and a little more jump. Mind up, crit up. Oof. Alright, Andine, we move you up here. Yep, this is what I expected. Yep, Whirling Blow. Then we get counterattacks. All right, Glint, uh, we're basically done with you. So if you move this here, one, two, it, they could move there and charge. Oh, actually, it's going to get a chance. It's going to, uh, well, it can't charge because its, its friend is in the way, I think. So we'll leave you here right now, and you'll potion Suzuki. All right, Pellier, let's go ahead and... Oh, I can't move you up because this thing's in the way. Okay, well, I want to wrangle, and I think we tag team? I think that's right. So we tag team... Okay, so first I have to choose who I want in the fight. So... Let's bring... Regal. Yep, that's right. Oh! Oh! I can place Regal anywhere I want! Oh! Well, not anywhere, anywhere I want, but within a certain distance of other creatures. That's good to know. Wait, I can't. Okay, oh, I can't do that. Okay, I have to choose a creature that I'm replacing it with. All right, so that's what we have to do. And let's end your turn uh, here, Pellier. Kiri. So do I overreach to hurt this creature? 87, da that's a nice amount of damage. Or maybe instead I drain health to heal yourself while we still damage it. And then we move you up to kill the pack. Let's do this. And we're trying to get to that pectite. Wow, that was super unlucky for the poor Pectite, missing both of us with a fire too. And now it's muted. And it's also slowed. Oh, poor thing. So I th I'm hoping I can kill this with Suzuki, Yates, and Regal. So instead, I'm going to move Anadine up here. Oh my god, this thing's defense is 354. If I attack it, how much damage can I do? 42 damage with holy chance. If I was to do a rage blow, oh. I don't think it's worth it for you, Anadine. I think we actually. So, what's your movement? One, two. Th can we? I don't. I think this is too high up. I don't think we can attack it. No. Okay, then, Andy, we are going to move you here. And you will Holy Justice... Holy Chant? Uh, 
If you're gonna do that, Tim, move her maybe in front of the zombie so that Kiri can go after the cell fight. Actually, it'll gain resistance if I do that. Maybe we don't even bother with that either. We just rage. I thought you would do more damage, Andy. How much is this thing's defense? Sorry, everyone. Uh, 174. Andy, we need to somehow... 258 damage. That is a decent amount. Maybe we go into the cave and we use the demonic might on her? Who's going in what order? Uh, you need to be careful, Tim. If you move her there... The zombie might move up to attack Anadine, and then Kiri can't reach the... Well, then again, they both be lined up... No, because Kiri would have to be down here. Move, move here. And... Do the, do the Holy Justice. No, because I want Kiri to do it. Kiri's mind is higher. She'll do more damage. Here you go. Uh, how about you rend it? Alright, Yates, um, I kind of don't want you in this area. I want all, all of us to begin moving up in this direction. So let's treatment, mass, maybe I can, do I thorns both of them or do I want to poison, um, uh, let's, sure, let's poison the, uh, the monster, if I can. And then we move you over here. Suzuki. Oh, hey! Holy crap! You can jump... You, wow! You can make it over here? You're four, four and eleven. Regal, where, where can you go? Okay, Regal, Regal can make it up there too. So let's move Suzuki here. And we will... Let's see. It should be... I think this is going to be a normal attack, Tim. Oh my god! That's wonderful! 120 damage! Now you need to be a little careful with Regal, Tim. My original plan was to move it here and spray them with a beam attack, but I'm a little worried that you'll take a lot of damage. Doctor Anonymous, what do you... You don't have Panacea... Oh, you have Panacea 2. Okay, so we can get rid of that defense when you get to go again, Yates. But if I move Rago up here, the zombie will move up and probably attack him. What's the zombie's movement? One, two, three. You're all together, Tim. That's a good spot for another fire, too. Just be aware that's a thing. Yeah, we, we can't beam up there. Let's just end. 
Alright, Pillier, this thing's almost dead, so let's kill it. Oh, that was a big mistake, Tim. You should have moved Regal up here and beamed. Because then you could have used his, uh... The one ability that makes all his, all the beasts attack whatever is directly in front of them. That would have been a fantastic use of it. But you've screwed it up, so... Oh, I should have also tried to tame one of those things, right? These are beasts. I think we can tame them. So that was another mistake. You're not doing too good, Tim. <laughs> You're not doing very well here. All right, Curie, and you still can't reach the, the creature. But now I can use my Wrath a Holy Beam? Doesn't really do that much more damage. And the creature is muted, so you don't really have to worry about it anyway. Um, I think I move you here, and we do a push. Your Zol, Tim. He still has his defense down. That's going next. It's probably moving here and attacking Kiri. Want you doing anything? <clears throat> ah, move up anyway, Tim. And you might be able to, with 40 magic points, can you kill this thing? Almost can kill it. You can't reach that creature to attack it. Nothing else will be able to contribute to the fight. Can we kill the Pectite? No. We only do one point of damage with our attack. It's already muted, so that's not going to really help me either. Oh my god, but our beam will kill it! Let's do that. Alright, Yates, let's move you here. And we will... Treatment, recovery... I can't reach them. It'll heal the zombie a little, but I'll be okay with that. Suzuki might be able to kill the zombie. Let's see. So if, I, if I attack normally, how much damage did you do? So only 78. Okay. Oof, that actually heals it. Okay, so we don't want any of that. Uh, I guess we just attack. I'm making all sorts of mistakes. Like, tons and tons of mistakes this, uh, this fight. <laughs> And I faced Suzuki the wrong way. Can I attack it from here with my spear? We can. It'll kill it. Let me get some jammy fruit. 
And Polir has leveled. Alright, Regal. So if I move you here, I could beam. Let's do it. Oh, counter shove. Hmm. Okay. Uh, what do you have on you? Do you have... So you do have smart casting. If I move you here, and I use ancient power, we could use holy burst. Uh, that doesn't do as much damage as I was hoping it would. You're gonna have... Don't do what you're thinking, Tim. Move... to earth, Tim. And it's resistant to dark. If you move yourself here... Why don't you move yourself... No, that's a good spot for the Pectite to AoE all... Well, Regal's going... Sure, we'll move you here, and let's use a potion on Regal. Anadine. We can use Corrupted Blade to kill one of them. Cleave! I always forget about Cleave. So... I think we move you over here away from everyone else? Or I do kind of want you healed. But I can use a potion on you. Yeah, let's move you up here, Anadine, and face you this way. And we'll use a potion on yourself. So now you're up there all alone. And we'll move you behind this thing. Yates! What are we doing with you? We can poison this thing, and I think we will do that. The poison did not work. Okay. All right, Palir, let's... We'll have you buff the pets from over here while I try to work our way up here to get some of that dragon sap. And we'll use a... Frenzy. Then we're gonna attack up to both of them. Suzuki. What am I attacking with you? I d we're gonna get. Oh no! This one doesn't have the magic points, so it's it's not going it's not going to uh, lightning three me. This is the one with counter shove, Tim. Is that right? Yes. I 
think team, we still need to kind of hit it. Oh! I forgot all about Earth Burst. So I could move here with it. And then we could... Earth Burst? I have to move here instead, is that right? But that hurts me a lot more than it. Uh, I'd have to move, I think, here. Oh my god, that's wonderful. And it'll die. Holy Suzuki, you are amazing. Regal. I think we move you up here. And we just attack. Oh, nice. Kind of mute stuck. So you're not casting any more spells now, Pectite. Ancient, I think I can reach with the holy. I can't reach with the holy. Can I beam it? The dark breaths. And he cannot be healed currently. Clear. Let's get some dragon sap with you. Yates. Um, well, I don't think a treatment gets rid of weaken. Sorry, recovery. Oh, oh, recovery does get rid of weaken. Okay. It won't heal her, but the weekend will go away. And now, Anadine. Can we kill this with an enraged blow? No. Suzuki, I'm in the way again with all my people. We'll move you up, and I guess we'll use War Shell. Regal. They're both hurt. This is going next. This has no counter. Let's move you up. Oh, actually, this uh, this can't cast a spell because it's muted. So let's Zol Zol heal. And now we can start moving toward where that treasure chest is located. I hope. Can I? Uh... I might not be able to make that jump down? I can't. I have to get here to go down here for the treasure chest, and you don't have the jump distance. But you know what does? Someone else. So we can tag team Lint. No, I'm too far away uh, for that. I'm too far away from it. Okay, so I can't do that. Okay, well, we can attack, I suppose. Is that right? Hold on. 
Yeah, yeah, we, we can do that. So let's move you down here. And we wrangle, attack. Oh my god! That's a thing they can do? They can sacrifice themselves. They can sacrifice themselves to bring a new, uh, a different creature into the battle. I'm oh, sorry, not a new creature. I guess one of the old creatures. <sighs> Kiri, I don't think... You have the ability to hit people, people from ranged, so we should take advantage of that. Oh, hold on. You can move over here. You have the jump distance. So let's have you begin working your way towards that, tre that treasure chest. Yates, we can move you up. And we can... Anatomy... I could... I could... No, let's... Uh, I think I'm going to mass slow them. Only got one of them, unfortunately. Hyladine, let's move you up here. Holy chant will hurt whatchamacallit, but it actually might benefit us if, if uh, Regal decides to absorb the mana. Okay, he did not. Oh, he did! Alright, good! Potion! Need a better potion than that. So I think, can I Hollow Fangs, Dark Breath? Oh my god, 160 damage. Would poison him and maybe apply whatchamacallit. Could I move you a little more? I cannot. Uh, Suki, can you... I think to you, you do what you were about to do. You go ahead and you use char uh, you use gr Hollow Fang's Dark Breath. Unless, wait, with Snake Eyes? No, this is fine. Well, Dark Breath. Which faces you in that direction. Regal, you can stay here and just a uh, attack it. So we could beam to kill them both, but I'm going to have Paleo do an attack, which should kill the thing in the back. Actually, maybe we Zol heal yourself. Instead, Regal. And we just keep you there. And Paleo, you continue to try to rejoin us. And we do another wrangling attack. Next turn, we get that treasure chest. Awesome! And here we can treatment, recovery. Palaire, we can move you up. And then... I guess we could attack again. Right, there's no reason not to. Actually, let's, let's use attack. No, not attack, sorry. Uh, frenzy. Now, 
Now we could have Andine kill this thing, I think, if I attack it from behind. But I'm gonna Heavy Potion instead, Suzuki. Because I want the treasure chest next round, so we're delaying around. And Suzuki, I know you can kill it probably if I was to attack it from. Oh, it won't quite do so. Then, you know what? Yeah, then let's attack it. It's a good thing that this creature didn't have, like, the Earth Stomp ability. Oh, it was crippled that round anyway, so I guess it wouldn't have mattered. A Battle Claw! This is the item in the treasure chest. The creature, why, uh, the, their beetle wisely moved away. Actually, we can Holy Magic heal. And I don't need another beetle. We're just going to kill this thing rather than try to tame it or anything of the sort. So, I think we anatomy Dark Locust and that's it. Well done, guys. So we picked up... We got a Lunar Crest for that battle as well. So someone else can be a werewolf. I think this is, these are different things we picked up than what we actually... Like, this Dragon Blood Sap is not the Dragon Blood Sap we picked, we harvested. We got this from winning the fight. A Swindle Fruit. Kiri Never Falls bonus. Andine is the MVP? I don't know. I think Suzuki was there. All right. So let's go... Go to camp, and we'll level a few people, and then we'll look at these crests. So, Kiri, Alchemistic, I think I'm holding on to Resistance Expert with you. For Plague Doctor, we'll grab Mass Slow. For Samurai... Hmm... Grant's focus. I like her current counter slow. I'll never take that off of her. Deal physical damage attack, ignores the target's defense, also puts resistance down on this character. Is there any reason why I'm keeping her, why I'm leveling her as a samurai? I think it was just because I wanted to see what, what their abilities are. I don't think I care about this any longer, though, for her. We'll grab Restless Spirit. And I guess she'll take Frenzy over here. Not like I'm going to ever make her a Wrangler. Now, let me take a look at her class as well. Because I don't know if I want to level you as this. Let's see. 4.8 attack, 3 defense, 3.5 mine, 3.1 resistance, 2 speed, a little bit of hit points, a little bit of magic. Marked has less hit points, double the magic points, more attack, more defense, more mind, more resistance, and the same speed. So, okay. So there's no reason for me to to level her. Unless I'm going to master this for the attack plus 5, speed plus 2, plus 2 crit. It'd be better for me just to keep her as a marked. We gain one jump and we lose three crit by making her back into a mark. But you know, I I, I think we do this. I think I'm done uh, leveling Kiri as a samurai. I don't, I'm not going to really use those passive abilities very much at all. Yeah, we'll, we'll, let's keep her as a marked. I'm now at the at the point where I care more about leveling the peace people as classes, even if they've mastered it for those growths, than unlocking a few more abilities from a class that I don't think I'll, e I'll ever use. This is this is playing into the, the whole uh, the vampire dilemma I had an episode or two ago, where I couldn't make up... 
I realize that there's almost no reason to level Walter as a vampire because there's only like one ability from it that I might use and it's a passive that lets him float and move uh, fly as he moves around the uh, the board and it's just I don't think it's worth all that leveling for that and I don't think I'm going to use anything for Martial Spirit so the only question now is what do I give her as her secondary Let's, so I'm, I'm taking a look. Let's see. Survival, treatment, Warcraft. So Warcraft could be nice. We have all those abilities unlocked for her there. I also have Chivalry. Let's take Warcraft. I don't think I have anyone who has this. And occasionally it's very nice to have someone who has, like, attack down for the enemy or mine down. Flash Strike is useful and the push could also be really useful. I like smart casting with ancient power. Do I want resilience or do I want something else? I really wouldn't mind taking resistance expert on her, but I don't have that. So that's not gonna happen. I guess we'll we'll leave resilience on her at the moment. seeing 138 resistance. I really want more, but we'll, we'll leave her as this. Alright, Rainer, what have you learned? Oh, hold on a second. Curie still has... Oh, that's that's alchemistic, Tim. Plague Doctor. We'll take Mass Thorns, just to be different. War Mage unlocked for you, but I don't think I'm making you one. I am still saving for economy. Danny. Let's grab... See, your resistance is decent at the moment, so I don't need resistance expert on you. I'd rather you have another kind of active ability. So, let's take Soul Tendrils for another AoE damage on you. Milner, no one leveled as a Fellblade, so we still have to keep you there. Or rather, no Fellblade engage in that fight. You and Rainer have to spend some time fighting together so that we can get you a Fellblade point so I can put Malice on you as a secondary passive ability. Nope, you're holding on to for counterattack here, Tim. But no one's leveling as a Merc. Okay, whatever. That I, I, don't, have, I don't have to spend the points. Let Gark... Do I want sabotage with you? I, uh, no, we'll hold off for cautious step. Darley dagger for your reaver. We'll take primal blow. Mr. Simons, you've earned some stuff as a gunner. I think probably should give you one of the passives. I should give you one of the passives. So, let's grab Concentration. Uh, no, let's grab Height Advantage, Tim. This way you go for, you go down here a little more. The Assassin's now. By that, I mean we unlock further abilities in the skill tree. Anadine... Holding on for item potency, I, I guess. For Templar, you've earned quite a few points here. We'll take a Bolding Chant. For that plus damage to off allies in the area. You've mastered Plague Doctor, Yates. We're still saving for Boon. You've earned something from Wrangler. Let's just take Calm. Okay, so I guess we change you to a wizard to get you those final points. So let's change your class to a wizard. I, uh, your equipment was changed. It's always annoying. All right, this will just have to do. That's all there is to it. 
you were using probably a water rod. No, you were using something different altogether, but I, don't, I think it was a healing staff. Lancaster, you've earned, oh, the final night thing. So you are done leveling up. So, we could make him a, another werewolf. He couldn't use his heavy armor though, Tim. Why don't you think about that off screen? For deft, tool user gets unlocked. We also learn Precise Strike, so now he can use all those abilities, Open, Gather, Climb, etc. And he can use items. For you, Pillier, I guess we'll take Hunt now to deal fire damage to monster units and reduce damage to non-monster. Counts as a regular attack. And one more thing, and then you've mastered your Wrangler class. Suzuki. What are we kicking with you? Skeletal. Soul suck or devour. I think devour. When a unit, when that, when character defeats a unit, it restores twenty percent of their max hit points. Suzuki tends to kill things when he attacks them, so we'll totally grab that. Oh, you've mastered this actually. We can take soul suck, and you are done with with skeletal. Okay, we are we are going to have to do some class changes, Tim. Uh, Glint has mastered her venomous. Zaro has finished mastering the Therva with Zolbeam. Okay, we gotta spend a lot of time here doing class changes. Kukurio is not quite done with Deft. He gets Tool User. And for Scout, he gets Critical Focus. He doesn't have a counter ability, so he'll... Oh, he... I forgot to give him one. Let's totally take Counter Root. Okay, and I have a bunch of people who need to change their classes, so why don't I... Th I'll be thinking about this off-screen, everyone, and I'll be right back after I've done it, because leveling takes some time, but class changes require me really thinking about things, and that could take, like, 30 minutes of me thinking. So I'll be... I'll be back. Okay, I'm done. It's been an hour and a half. <laughs> it's been an hour and a half, and I've almost done nothing to any of these people, and I've tried to record this part, like, 20 times now, and I keep failing to describe what's going through my mind. Here... Here's a summary. Almost nothing happened. Uh, I flip-flopped on people over and over again, making them into different classes, and then changing my mind, putting them back to their original classes. Here's the only things that matter. T Tillman's now a plague doctor temporarily, because it turns out to be a lich, you need plague doctor for sorcerer six. The new crest is not made for a plague doctor though. The new crest we got is used to make something called a vessel, which is a summoner. I believe, in this game. Uh, it looks like most of its abilities are AoEs, and they use Mind as your stat. Looking at the growths in particular, we can see that it gives you a ton of magic points and a large amount of Mind growth. So, it's it's a summoner class. And uh, I might make myself that class. Uh, Yates is a wizard, no one cares. This Another werewolf crest was given to Lancaster to make him into a werewolf. Uh, I might leave him as Werewolf as his primary, because I'm thinking I like those stat growths, and we'll leave him as a Templar as his secondary, uh, but he will need some points as Merc, so I can unlock the uh, Sturdy Grip, so he can use a shield as well. It's something to do, to do for the future. There's been a small amount of changes while we're here. Uh, Zaro is now an Arpia, and I think Kakurio is a Mykonoid. And in the end, that was it. There's a bunch of babbling I've been doing incoherently, attempting to explain my reasoning for all this stuff. No one cares. Let's just go ahead and be done with that nonsense and go to the guild and send people out on guild missions and then we're off to the temple. Okay, let's do this. So, one more time as a Candia, we have a new mission unlocked. Landslide. Oh, and we get another Lunar Crest, in case we didn't have enough werewolves in our group. We also get something called Everspring. A landslide has blocked this road and many hands are needed to clear it. I wouldn't call it a high priority for an Arbiter, 
but it's important to the locals. Brute strength would not go amiss on a job like this. 97 ability points. Perfect. Perfect. So I think we need a werewolf for this. So let's send Lancaster. You're going along as well, Tillman, because I want you to get the Plague Doctor points. And we need two levels of them for you. And then maybe we send Darley Dagger? Or Suzuki? Let's send Suzuki. Alright, guys, good luck. Okay, next. Uh, I guess we should keep sending people out on other missions... So, let's get some more influence points. A group of feral creatures has been terrorizing people in the region. I believe that during the day, they've been making their den somewhere around the falls. If I were you, I'd bring a monster to sniff them out. 225 influence points. So, let's send... Clint, you'll lead the group. Uh, High-level people should go, Tim. People you don't intend to... Bring with you on the next mission. So we'll bring Litgark. Because you're level 19, sir. And... Hmm. Pellier. And then one more person, Tim. Bring Ragel. Now right, you guys go. We get one more. So let's go back to Centena Hinterlands. And nope, it was this one that has the bit, little bit of everything in it. Nope. Was it really Zacandia? Yes, it was. All right. Let's do this one. Necromancy has raised its gray and withered head once more. I am unsure who is behind the appearance of these walking dead, but an arbiter is needed to grant them final rest and quickly. A little bit of everything. So... I'm going to bring... Who's going to lead this group? Denver, you'll lead it as a Templar Knight. Mr. Simons, you'll go along. Because you're level... Oh, you're only level 17. I want to use the viewer's characters, though, Tim, in the next battle if we can. Send Simons. Send Simons, send the Met. She'll gain a level. And send Mad Mart again. Okay. With all of those people out, let's save the game. Oh, that wasn't so uh, bad. Oh, I kept... I also did reload the game a few times when I bought equipment and changed my mind. <laughs> all right. Let's head to the Kender Spires. These desert towers are architectural wonders of the world, yet they only hint at the vast network of Zil tunnel dwellings beneath the ground. Why is it so quiet? I don't know, but I don't like it. Stay alert. Something is definitely off. Told you we'd be meeting again, didn't I? It took her as a girl out, you know. Being right all the time. I like this meeting better already. You don't have a hostage to hide behind. Ha! Funny girl. I just knew there was something I liked about you. What does Sigil want with us this time? You figured it out, eh? Yeah, I'm with Sigil. My task is to keep any Mar from completing the pilgrimage. That's why I'm here. To see that you drop out of the quest. I saw you helping folks in Old Bazaar and Thesperius. I can tell you're a good sort, a woman of principles and all that. Here's me deal. Swear to me you'll abandon the pilgrimage, and that'll be that. Easy peasy. Wasn't that breezy. 
an interesting proposal. Here's my counteroffer. For the crimes of kidnapping, ransoming, and attempted murder, the law allows your capture, dead or alive. You'll surrender peacefully, and we'll make that alive. <laughs> Perhaps you've got to teach too many principles at that. I suppose we do it the hard way, then. And don't think you'll be surprising me with your weirdly demon powers this time, little miss. I knew it was too quiet. They were in position before we even got here. Now we're surrounded. Do you have a plan? She's obviously the leader. Take her down quickly, and I bet the rest will scatter fast enough. Righty-ho! Y'all, this is no bunch of lightweights. No quarter, no how. What are we dealing with? So we've got... Zills here with us. Level 18, level 20, level 20, level 20, level 20. This is why I wanted to do all that leveling. We are going to be vastly under level compared to them. All right. Well, not vastly. Two or three levels below. That's, that's super awkward. Reaver Assassin, Pectite Vangle, Assassin Plague Doctor, Bounty Hunter Assassin, Samurai Merc, Another Zill. Okay. So, that's not so bad. We have seven of them? <laughs> is that right? Or is it just six? S six of them. And she has initiative, I think. Is that correct? She does not, but she's going first. Impetus. Speed increases every turn by 0.05x up to 0.3x gain. Loyal Friends. Counters any offensive action taken on the character by bringing out a known pet. And immediately using its pet effect. Alright, so she's a beast tamer. It says Bounty Hunter here. Oh, this is her own special thing. I bet you we get her as a as the unlockable character later on. It's going to be my guess. Alright, um... I'm sure their abilities are very fierce and, and scary, but, uh, well, we're just not going to bother looking at them. What could go wrong? Let's go ahead and begin placing people. So, I think I wanted viewers here. So, Danny, we'll bring you. <coughs> Milner, we'll bring you. Wolf, you will come along as well. I think, Quill, do I have you around here, or did I send you out on a mission? I have you. Let's bring you. And you have initiative, so you'll be going first. Actually, with that in mind, because, uh, wait, hold on. Does Wolf, not Wolf, this, I keep thinking Wolf has, uh, whatchamacallit, um, uh, Fleet of Foot, and he does not have Fleet of Foot. So, no, don't don't bring Quill. Um, oh, Leonara, you're only level 17. We'll bring you. Milner, I think I still do want you. And then we have two more people. Walter. What abilities do you have for Gunner? Uh, only two of them. We need more points for you. Uh, slowing Bullet is very good, but I would want more, so no, we won't bring you for this. Um, is Legark around, or did I send him out on a mission? I sent him out on a mission. <sighs> Danny will take you as, with us as well. Actually, it looks like, uh... No, this is... Uh, that's, that's fine. That's a fine position. Leonardo will go first... Actually, if Leonardo's going first, let's do this instead. Leonardo, what are you, Leonardo? You are... You're a druid mender, if I recall correctly.
Danny. All these things, like, not a lot of resistance, a lot of defense on them. At least on that. Oh, because that one's a peck type thing. Okay, let's let's go 50-50 uh, with magic and um, and whatchamacallit. So where am I? I'll put myself here as well. All right, we're set. Let's do it. I didn't assign anyone that new glove I got at the end of the last battle. I just realized that right now and I wanted to give it to Milner. It's too late. Actually, is it too late? It's not too late. We can do it right. We can do it right now. So instead of the sharp gauntlet, if I give you the battle claw, you will lose immune to bleed. You pick up attack, defense, and resistance. Is there something better for you to have? Oh, that's five crit though on you. I think we give it maybe to Wolf instead. Oh, he's also using a sharp gauntlet. I kind of like it. I want everyone to have boots on them. You'll be fine, Tim. Just just do this. We can agonize over that later, too. All right, let's proceed with these units. Rush someone up here, and I do. Let's give total shield to Milner. And you'll, uh, you have mana font? Do. So I kind of want to move you. But it should be forward you move her, Tim. Hold on. Before I do that, where can you move? You have a bow, but you just got done moving. You have a bunch of magic spells. So you are a caster type. Uh, we'll, move, we'll move Leonara up after all. You're going to get hit anyway, Leonara, so let's move you here. Okay, so... Let's use a... Oh! If I move you up... No, I can't hit them with a Mass Slow yet. Let's treatment Mass Thorns? Or do I want a Barrier? So the, the only really awkward part is both of these people are assassins. So that means they probably have Dispel Powder. Yep. Dispel Powder, Dispel Powder. So all these bosses I'm about to put on us, they can easily be taken off by them. But I think we do it anyway. So let's use a Mass Barrier here. Move you up only a tiny bit. Wolf, uh, we charge you up. And that's kind of all you're going to do. We'll end your turn. If I move you here, nothing's in range. We could use Leap to move you up a tad bit more. You know what? I'm going to do this. 
Oh, I can't do it. Oh, I can't leap if there's no targets. Let's use regenerate to give you renew. Actually, no, let's not do that. You're gonna, you're gonna, all your stuff's gonna be dispelled, I think, by one of these assassins. Kiri, what's the height difference here? Six. You have jump five, so we can't even move you up there. We have to all be slow at moving up. Uh, where can these enemies reach? Okay, so I'm going to use haste on wolf. I should stay near everyone else. Let's move here. Ooh, slow and can't use any abilities, but that doesn't mean can't cast spells. Ah, I was hoping she wouldn't even fight. Like everyone's using everyone's using Mirage. Every single person. Wolf, if I move you here and we dark blade and we do a black blade, it would maybe blind this guy and damage him and get rid of the Oh, the Reaver doesn't even have a uh, Mirage. Do I want to do that? Or do I want to sleep him? I think we hit. I think we hit both of them. Yeah, let's use Black Blade. Oh, it did have Mirage on it. Okay, gotcha. All right, that, then I'm really glad that we did what we did. Whew, thank goodness. That did not enrage her, uh, Kiri. Wolf, if I move you here, we could howl. Oh, we could also, uh, gutter snipe to, like, move her someplace, this person someplace else. Can't root the assassin, might root the other two. Maybe we don't do that. Maybe we move here. Can we kill? Uh, let's think. If I move here and I. Can I leap? I, I can't leap there because I won't be able to damage uh, their. Actually, I can't damage your thing. Can I? If I leap from here, I can't do that either. Okay. Um, darn it! By moving Wolf there, I can't like uh, breathe uh, weakness on all of them. Let's see. I. Can we kill one immediately, Tim? Can you kill this peck type? Oh, well, its defense is so high. I don't think we'll be able to do that. Yeah, okay. We're not probably... Well, you might kill it with, uh... Your other characters, Tim. 
we can move them up and they can get their spells off on the enemies up here. Normally I don't like moving Milner all the way up here, but it might be... Well, let's do this. And I think we will stick with the Howl. A hill gain... Oh, so he'll gain barrier and won't be rooted and take a tiny bit of damage. The other two will be rooted. No, Howl's not what I want to do. It really isn't. That's nice. I heard 12 damage on their Reaver. The only problem is that will greatly increase his damage as well. And I don't think I'll kill him. What do all your beast abilities do? Let's see. The Gutter Snipe could be useful. Has a chance of poisoning them and you get a pet. You gain defense up and you get a pet. That would actually be nice as well. You know what? I'm really tempted to, to use that. Yeah, let's use let's use the Zerk Rubbling. I know it doesn't do that uh, that much damage, but it'll give Milner defense up, which I really want him to have. Oh, sorry, it would give granted it to him if he had that pet uh, out already. So if I move here, I'll use Ancient Power, Wrathful Burst, won't kill him. Uh, let's think here. Stick with a lesser ability to maybe Holy Bolt. If you want to kill this guy, you need to focus on him. Wow. Kiri also took a ton of damage for some reason. Oh, the fire spells, Tim. The fire spells. She'll be okay. Use a use a dark bolt. Yep, she'll be okay. Alright, Leonara. You have enough to cast, I think, twice. So if I use a double cast and we use, like, a thunder one? Milner will take a hit and she'll, he'll, he might cripple you with a counter. Oh, that damage, though, on that enemy. Oh, you know what? We, we can put it here. So we won't hit... Uh, this guy, who has a mirage on him, but we will hit the pet tight. We we can't hit Wolf because he has evade magic. Let's do it. And then we do that again, or maybe I just now single bleed. Yeah, which will kill it if it hits him. <laughs> Danny... Uh... What am I doing with you? <laughs> I'm a little nervous. Um, if I move you up too far, you will be hit by all these others. Oh, uh, or you won't be. Okay, so let's move you up here. All right, that's not really where I want you to go. So I guess instead we'll move you here. And can we use a treatment? Which will heal Kiri a little and heal Milner a little. That was dumb. I should use Refresh, I think, instead.
Hmm. If I move myself up and I use soul magic refresh here, it'll heal you a tiny bit, Wolf, and it will refresh your haste. It won't do anything for what you would call it. I wouldn't mind his abilities being improved as well, but I simply... I have to choose to either give your defense resistance up another round, Milner. I really do kind of want to do that. We could do it here as well, but we'll accidentally extend him and heal him a tiny bit. I don't want to do that. Um, do I have anything else I could use? We could do a renew for three rounds on them, which would be, I think, better. Let's do that. And apparently I, I want just a single renew. Okay, nice. They brought one of their friends back and they have healed him almost a full life again. Double attack on the assassin has killed Wolf. Oh. And Kiri is almost dead. Oh, this got really bad very quickly. I think with him dead with through bloody trophy, I don't think he can be resurrected. Kiri. Can we kill this guy? Maybe we can. Let's move you back here, and we might have the power needed to revive two on Wolf to bring him back here. We can move you, Danny, up here. And we can use a soul magic to put a shield on all of us. And I am the odd man out <laughs> down here. Oh, you know what? I can move over here. Let's do that. Oh, or I can't. I can't... I, it says I can move there? There we go. And now I'm with the team. And we can even soul magic renew? Uh, I can't quite renew... Renew? I can't quite uh, renew where I want. Let's use a mana stone on ourselves. Wolf, time for some vengeance. Oh, that actually won't do any damage to him. Uh, we need an infused edge. 
Um, Thunderbolt? Which will kill him if it hits him. And we get a phylactery! <laughs> oh, that was wonderful! Alright, Wolf, and now we, uh... Uh, we move you up. That is so lucky that Kiri has not yet fallen. So, I can move you here. And what else can we do? He's not hurt, so this will do a decent amount of damage to him. Uh, so, deals damage equal to one-fourth of target's hit points. 65% chance of inflicting poison. If the pe uh, pet effect. Has a 65% chance of inflicting poison. Just, okay, so we don't we don't care about that. Um, deals holy damage target and grants the character renew. Unit with... We, 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 pet effect restores mind hit points to adjacent allies. I thought I had an ability to, like, move someone. But I guess I don't. So, let's use the... Kindling to give yourself renew, Milner. Right, and the other pet damages it a bit as well. Alright, uh, Kiri, you are badly hurt, but I think Leonara has Blessed One? And she's a little hurt, so I'm not going to bother healing with you. We're going to move you up here, and we'll just continue to Ancient Power. Actually, can we... Oh, we can't drain life on him. He's too far away. Can we Holy Bolt? I guess that's fair. We, d uh, we dodged his attack, or her attack, and so she does the same to us. Leonara will move you up here. And you will holy magic heal one. It needs to be a heal two. Wolf! Darn it! Can't reach him. think he can hit us with a AoE spell if I move you down here. we ha Actually, we have to be worried about the samurai. But I wouldn't mind sleeping this jerk. Crit? Critical? Danny? Um, you are hurt. I am going... You could probably use a heal. I don't want to take another wind ability, AoE damage hit. You have renew. You know, you have defense up. We'll kill him next turn with like an AoE or something. Or my lay waste when I use it will kill this guy. So let's instead... Can I poison? No, immune to poison. Can we weaken? No. Too far away. So, okay. Can we refresh? Here? So she'll gain 
Her defense will refresh. His defense will refresh. His renew will refresh. Let's do that. And then Danny will move you. If I move you here, you're going to be hit by this guy's samurai stupid spell. But I need you kind of around, so we will move you up here anyway. You have renew on you, so you'll heal a few hit points too. Oh, I'm okay with that. That's fine with me. So, let's use our Lay Waste. They can all take... 64... He won't, he won't be critical, so he won't gain critical quicken. We will be countered by the Samurai taking, doing magic to me. I guess then I should use the Firestorm. Because that does a little more damage. I also should... I guess I should move a little closer. She actually can't make it up to me, either. So let's move myself here. And then we can soul ma- um... Lay waste firestorm? Reminds me of Golden Axe. I'm fine with that. You two can just kill each other over and over again. Continue to lick each other in the middle of combat. No more special abilities for you, Katja. Now it's our turn! <laughs> now it's our turn. And I think I'll keep you here, because you'll get pet effects, and I think she's dead. No, she has like one hit point left. 17. All of us are going next, so this is hopefully over. So let's... Let's throw the rock. All tougher than ye look. I'll be seeing ye. We'll be ready for her tricks next time. I'm surprised we she didn't say you'll be you're smarter than you. Wilner just didn't interrupt her and put the sledgehammer in the back of her skull. <laughs> oh, that was fun. That was that, I was worried for a little bit there actually that we were going to lose, but then I realized that. Leonara had enough mana after she moved to bring Wolf back at full life uh, with with the better revive than what than the Phoenix potion. We got some quality thread from that. We got a phylactery. Milner gains MVP. Yeah, I can see that. Yep. And again, though, like I think everyone really did well here. I think the only person who I guess didn't would be Kiri. Everyone else kind of pulled their their weight in this fight. Well done, everyone. And Wolf, yep, you took it. You took that death. I forgot assassins have attacked twice. Uh, to be honest, that wouldn't have changed my mind about what I did with you. Ooh, that guy looks really grumpy. Hmm. Once again, my apologies. Unnecessary. Arbiters are meant to protect citizens, not the other way around. I did notice some locals taking part in that ambush. Um, yes. If they had assistance from Zills, it would explain how a band of outsiders could set up an ambush without anyone noticing. After all, most of us live in caves under the city. But why would Zills help Sigil with their dirty work? Hmm. Members of Citadel have been very active in Zykander Spires for some years now. 
discontent with the rule of the immortals has been growing, especially among our younger generations. But what specifically is their complaint? Hmm. Many things. But the biggest issue is their prohibition on arming our own guards, forcing us to rely on arbiters for our safety. I understand your concerns, Elder. I promise you, if I can at all influence the Council policies, I will make it a priority to improve relations with your people. Which brings me to the reason for our visit. We require access to the Sealed Temple. Hmm... The Sealed Temple. Yes, of course. Hmm... I'm afraid this is going to be difficult. What's difficult about it? Hmm... When news reached us of the Mart coming here for the pilgrimage, a few sigil sympathizers flooded the Sealed Temple. They flooded it? How is that even possible? Hmm. Living underground, we Zills are quite knowledgeable about tunnel networks and reservoirs and such things. We believe Sigil members diverted the flow of an underground river, raising the water level until the entire temple was submerged. The whole thing underwater. That's unfortunate. Hmm. Agreed. And there's worse news. The water level is so high, it is putting our entire harvest at risk. How irresponsible. Hmm. Quite. Hmm. We have, however, come up with a solution which would restore the water to its previous level, save our harvest, and grant you access to the sealed temple. I get the feeling this solution requires us to do the heavy lifting. Hmm. Quite. An explosive device must be placed under the lake by the blockage created by the members of Citadel. The resulting breach will release the floodwaters and... Hmm. Water levels should quickly return to normal. But... Hmm... But, hmm, the tunnels are infested with monsters, and as you well know, my people are not warriors. We understand the situation, Elder. As Arbiters, it is our duty to assist, even if we didn't need access to the Sealed Temple. Good for you, Kiri. Hmm, would that all Arbiters were as dutiful as you, young one. There was another group of Arbiters here recently. Their leader, a Captain Dolman, advised us to petition the Consul for assistance. Hmm. I do believe we'd lose our harvest before receiving a response. <sighs> How lazy! That particular group of Arbiters has already been... ...reprimanded. Hmm. That is good to hear. Perhaps I have grown too cynical in my elderhood. Do be careful in the tunnels. I have heard that some of the beasts down there may be... larger than normal. Thank you for the warning, Elder. All right, let's get this done. We've returned. The mission was a success. Good job, Lancaster. Another lunar crest. And that looks like a ring, Everspring. Ho ho, success. I deserve shinies. Give me, give me. Good job, Glint. Thank you. All those delicious influence points. We've returned. The mission was a success. Good job, Denver. Bit of everything. All right. Well, let's do the important thing. And see if Tillman got enough points to level Plague Doctor to four. He did not. Okay. We'll take Mass, uh, mass Slow. 
Darn it! You need 75 more points, Tillman. So I'll send you out on a guild mission in between episodes to make sure you get it. Because we earned that freaking phylactery dropped. In fact, uh, wait. Before we go any further, I should save the game. Because I get the impression that's not something that happens very often. And actually, I don't even know what it's what the Lich is capable of doing. So let's take a look at this really quick before we call the session. So here's the Lich. Yep. Oh my goodness. Plague Doctor 4. This whole time I was leveling you as a sorcerer and you weren't even done. Like you were a master class in sorcerer and was still playing you with as that. When I should have uh, converted you to a Plague Doctor. Okay. So what is this able to do? Let's take a look. Dark 1. Okay. Dark 2. Dark Locus. All early on, actually. Poison. Reanimate. So all of this we've seen before from other classes. Chilling Touch. Passive. Characters' offensive actions have a 75% chance of inflicting slow on the target. That is amazing. Especially if you combine that with Sorcerer Lay Waste. Holy crap. Hitting everyone with Earth like Meteor Storm and slowing them? That is amazing. That is amazing! Dark Storm, which we already have as the Sorcerer. Dark Burst, which we'll never use. Blood Magic. Ooh. Character uses hit points rather than magic points when using abilities. Uh, I don't think I... Well... Oh, abilities, Tim. Not spells. So... Uh, how would I know? I don't. Everything here says type spell, not ability. And Nightmare. Deals dark damage in a large area. Range 0 through 3, so it's castable away from you. 5 area, too, as well. Wow. And it's a 62% chance of inflicting poison. Where are the growths? Good. Good growths. For a magic user. Not as quite as good as the vessel, if I'm being honest. I think. Oh, a little more mind. A lot less magic points. Still, we'll absolutely do it. Okay. You also can't swim as a lich. Which is weird. Because you're you're a lich. You're dead. The moment we give you that phylactery. Okay. So, it's an interesting class. I'll, uh, do I want you leveling as the lich? I don't think so. Where is the... So, as the sorcerer, you gain more magic points... You gain less mind, slightly more speed. However, if I level you as the sorcerer, I don't have to take... I don't have to take blood magic as one of your two passives if I want to master the lich class, which I think I do. All right. So, interesting. I'm super glad we got the phylactery. I was just talking about that before I recorded this episode. That's amazing that we get one to drop. All right. So, that will do it for us, everyone. Thank you guys for watching. And I will do the leveling off screen. I'll do the leveling off screen. So, I will see you guys in the next one. Take care, everyone.